guys, my name is Ismas and welcome to Top Channel 111 and today we're going to be looking at some amazing news coming up in the industry. Moonray Render Engine is going open source. This is a DreamWorks animation tool used to render some of this year's hit animation movies like Bad Guys and Puss in Boots, The Last Wish. They're making it open source and that's thanks to the Academy. Yes, the Academy best known for running the Oscars. They are diving into software and technology, especially movie production software. Their master plan is to bring all the tools used in the industry to produce movies under one umbrella, free and open source. According to their research, 70 to 80 percent of tools used in the film in the film are free and open source, but because they are under different commercial companies, this creates challenges and it's been difficult to keep track of licensing and different versions of the software. The Academy is teaming up with Linux Foundation, not Linux Tech Tips. This is a software company to, to launch the Academy Software Foundation or ASW. F, a neutral forum for the movie industry to organize and collaborate around using open source tools. And it's aiming to reach far beyond our film and media. So this hopefully will further fed the fears of large Hollywood studios investing in open source software like Blender. In an interview with the Academy, they said they'll be trying to keep track of developers changing between companies and keeping track of different versions of open source software, making sure they can all communicate with each other, handling all the different licensing agreements and all the mechanisms of running the open source software for our industry and making it less complicated as it is right now. This should also make it easier for other developers and companies to contribute to open source software as there is a hierarchy to follow and someone to talk to if you want to make any contributions. Now to answer the big question, is Moonray coming to Blender? So that's a difficult question to answer as it hasn't really become open source yet. But I, I think around November, that's when they are making it fully open source. But after that, it should be just uh, as easy as implementing it into Blender. It's as the only step that is left is getting a developer willing to put in the time and work to have an implementation of Moonray inside Blender. And uh, that will only happen if there is enough interest in the render engine. So you, so you can go to right click select and make your ask, ask the developers to see if they can have that integrated into Blender. But don't demand too much because they are very busy guys. And uh, if they see that there is enough interest in the project, they might consider adding it into Blender. Let's have more than one render engine in Blender. It would be very, very amazing because sometimes Cycles has its limitations. So having another alternative there would be super amazing. Thank you.